Hello. Now we are going to look at linked list. It's again a list. It's called a linked list because uh, the, the linked part is the implementation detail. Again, we are going to implement a list, but we are going to implement it not using an array. We are going to use something else. We are going to use pointers for this. Again, what are the functions, the operations which are available for a list? We have four of them, add friend, remove friend, length and such, right? Okay. Now these are the operations which are available and we want, we are interested in uh, creating a list which works fast for these operations. That's our objective. Now let me just uh, explain to you how the linked list is represented. So we are going to implement a linked list of integers. It's going to look like this. Every node, this is called a node. This is a node which consists of two parts. The first part contains the element. So this is the element and next part is a pointer to another node. So the, the next part is going to point to another node. So this is node. This is also a node and this is going to point to again. So this part is the element and this is again going to point to another node and this can go on and on. Finally, there is a last node whose where is this point? So this is pointing to the next node here and where is this pointing to? This is pointing to null. So it's, it, it's null pointer. It's saying that it's not pointing to anywhere else. So this is a linked list and it's the and there's a head pointer which points to the first node. Right? And these elements contains the numbers which we are interested in. So this is a linked list of numbers and therefore this uh, the, the element here, this could be 10, this could be 20, etc. Okay. This is one representation of a pictorial representation of a linked list. Now, how do you how do I write a node? You can do, do that using a class, right? Let me write the class for you. There are two things in the class. The first one is int lm, right? Because it's it's a linked list of integers, so it's int lm. And the second one is a pointer to a node itself. So how do I write? I will, I'm going to write this is a class node. And head is a pointer pointing to a class node type. It is of type class nodes. Are. We have now written the class for node and how will the linked list is going to be? The linked list is going to have <coughs> the linked list class. So we are interested in implementing, right? So the linked list class is going to have the head pointer, which is uh, of type class node star and the functions, all these functions. That's what. So let me just note that down also. So class. I'll just call it list. Okay, the user, uh, the the user of our list need not know whether it's a linked list or an array, right? So class list, and I'm going to write and then it has all these functions. It's a, it has a function add friend, so I'll have to write. Okay, I'm going to leave the rest of the thing. So add friend will have an int, right? Because 10 uh, has to be added. That's the idea. And, 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 and similarly, there'll be other functions like this. This is going to be how my list class is going to be. Now there are a few things, which are the private and public members, which should be the public members. Clearly, the functions add friend and the remove friend length and search has to be public because people have to use it. So this has to be public. 
Now, what about the head pointer? The head pointer, should it be public? No, that need not be public. Others need not know about the head pointer. So, right, so that's, that's what it's private. So, this is now a representation for a linked list, but I never told you how it's going to work, how it's going to add or remove, etc. Now, initially, when a list is formed, when there are no elements in the list, what should head be? Head should be pointing to null because there is no element. Uh, the constructor of the list should be, should have the following function. So the constructor should be having right. It it should be setting head to null in the beginning, right? Because there is no uh, um, there is no node right now. Till now it's clear. Next question is how do I? So now we have the setting ready. We have now set up the list, and we have the class for the linked list. Uh, right. Next question we want to address is how do I? How do I write these functions, right? And we said that we want to write these functions to, so that it works efficiently. They have to work better than the our array data structure. That's what we are interested in. 